Good morning, Wolfpack. I'm Noah Seed. And I'm Ashley Borton. Today is Monday, December 13th, and we are here with your morning announcements. The yearbook is currently on sale for $75. However, the price will increase to $90 the first day we return from winter break, January 4th. You can pre-order your yearbook through the Drawson's website under the yearbook section of the school website. Congratulations to Samantha Meredith for winning the attendance drawing and earning a $25 gift card. If you would like the chance to win just like Samantha, be sure to have no tardies for a whole week. At the end of the term, six gift cards will be given to six students from the grade with the least amount of tardies. Currently, the seniors are in the lead, followed by the juniors, then the sophomores, and finally the freshmen. Let's get our attendance up, Wolfpack. Now let's pass it on over to Sterling and Gia for your weekly weather report. Good morning, I'm Gia. And I'm Sterling. And we're here with your weather update. Today we expect an informative weather report this week. As you can tell, this morning it's been raining, so make sure you wear your jacket the whole day. Oh, yes. <laughs> okay, Sterling, <laughs> anyways. So the rain is expected to stay for the majority of this week. Today we will have a wind advisory that will be in effect from 4 a.m. to 10 p.m. tonight. In more serious national weather news, there was a tornado outbreak that affected six different states across a more than 200 mile swath of land. With some of the worst effects being felt in the state of Kentucky, which is now declared a state of emergency after several E4 tornadoes. Due to the outbreak where many touchdowns occurred after nightfall, thousands of people have been left homeless and estimates put the death toll above 100 people. Well, that's all we have for you today, guys. I'm Gia. And I'm Sterling. Back, Back to, to the anchors. Thanks, guys. Attention students interested in playing softball. There is a mandatory meeting after school at 3.20 tomorrow, Tuesday, December 14th in Coach Raisin's room, HG4. Hope to see you there. Attention men's golfers, Coach Roth will be holding an informational meeting tomorrow, Tuesday, December 14th, during both lunches in HJ2. If you can't make the meeting, be sure to stop by HJ2 to sign up and get the information covered during the meeting. The library is hosting a warm-up with a good book reading event. Sign up to read a book of your choosing for 30 minutes this Wednesday, December 15th, from 8.45 to 9.15. There will be a hot be hot chocolate and a treat. There's a 25 person limit, so come to the library and sign up ASAP. Staff is welcome too. Don't forget that the library will be closed during lunch starting Wednesday this week due to class textbook returns. The library will also be closed Thursday and Friday after school due to the minimum day schedule. Feel free to come by before then and get some good reading books for the winter break. Now let's learn what AP World is all about. Hi, uh, my name is Mr. Summers and I teach AP World History. My class teaches the entire world's history going back 10,000 years ago, all the way up until the present. I think the difficulty in my class really comes down to whether or not uh, you're able to kind of compartmentalize your work. I don't give a lot of busy work, but the work that we do in class is very challenging uh, and does require a lot of critical thinking. There is a lot of writing, so this class involves reading, writing, a lot of English aspects come into this class. I think students should choose this class because if you really are serious about going to college uh, after high school, this is the kind of class that prepares you for critical thinking, for being able to process, formulate opinions, be able to support those opinions, uh, and it's not about memorization, but it's about understanding why things happen and being able to process that. Uh, I think you'll be better off for it uh, regardless of your ability level. I think you will learn a lot of valuable lessons taking this class. Thank you. Well, well, that's all we have for you today, Wolf Pack. I'm Noah Seed. And I'm Ashley Borton. Remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy, Happy National, National Violin, Violin Day, Day Wolf Pack. Wolf Pack.